one, the only, the Oscars. Featuring daily updates from Hollywood and your host, Antonio Sabato Jr., this is the Road to the Oscars. Hi, it's Tuesday, February 19th. I'm Antonio Sabato Jr., and welcome to the Road to the Oscars. We'll be coming to you every day with daily updates leading to Oscar night with exclusive looks behind the scenes on everything from the stage at the Kodak Theater to the food at the Governor's Ball. Oscar.com has got you covered. Now I'm here at Melrose Place, the epicenter of fashion. All of the major designers are working at this very moment to ensure the stars are red carpet ready. The Academy recently threw a fashion show focused on star style. Major designers premiere new looks inspired by Oscar fashion icons like Audrey Hepburn and Nicole Kidman. Some of the designers that participated were Marquesa, Ely Saab, Armani Prive, Oscar de la Renta, Pamela Rowland, Kevin Hall, and Valentino. We had a chance to talk to Patty Fox, who organized the show about her red carpet predictions this year's Oscars. As far as fashion trends on the red carpet, we'll probably see a lot of color. All eyes turn to that star when they step out of the limo. They're in a sea of black tuxedos, and if they pick the right fashion color, then you've got it. And the gowns would not be complete without diamonds. Just the gowns and the beautiful models looked great, but when you add the diamonds, I mean, there's just a whole aura that happens. Saying that diamonds make you smile is true. Each look was complemented with lavish necklaces, bracelets, earrings, and rings. Erin Sheba from Diamond Information Center, who pairs A-list celebrities with top great diamonds, talked to us a little bit about her favorite pieces and what she thinks we'll see on the red carpet. Oh, diamonds are a girl's best friend. There's nothing that puts that sparkle in her smile and that spring in her step when she walks the red carpet like diamonds. The big surprise we saw at today's Oscar fashion show was the return of big, bold, chunky diamond necklaces that really accentuate those strapless gowns that we're seeing. The first necklace that walked the runway was 65 carats of diamonds that came all the way from China. So it probably is the piece today that traveled the farthest to be here at the Oscars. Well, it's all speculations until the big night. Now, to see who's wearing what, be sure to tune into the Oscars Live February 24th at 5 p.m. Pacific, only on ABC. Now, check back tomorrow. We'll have everything you want to know about the iconic Oscars Dutch wet. See you tomorrow on the road to the Oscars.